So we've got to prove that the difference between two consecutive square numbers is always odd. You always have a choice of, of methods uh, when it comes to proof, but this one we're just going to go with an algebraic one. So what I'm going to do is say, okay, let's call our first number n. And then our second number is going to be the one after that. So that's going to be n plus 1. And what we want is the difference between the two consecutive square numbers. So the bigger of the two square numbers is the n plus 1. So let's square that. Work out the difference. So I'm going to do a subtraction. So there's the difference of my two consecutive square numbers. So now all I've got to do is um, expand the brackets, do a bit of tidying up, and let's see where we end up. So we've got the n plus 1 all squared. So that's going to be n squared plus 2n plus 1. Take away the n squared. There it is. And we can quickly see that that n squared is going to be cancelled out by that one there, leaving us with this thing here. Now, hopefully you should be aware uh, that if we have even numbers, they're of the form, let's call it 2m. Yes, yeah, so that's, that's a the 2 times table, because I've got any integer m multiplied by 2, it's going to be even. So therefore, the odd numbers are always of the form an even number, technically plus or minus one, I'm going to get for plus one. So what we've done is written our uh, expression, this thing here, in the form that is clearly an odd number. So there we go. There's your proof done.